Um, I'm just going to show you some shortcuts and things that you may not know about Doom Builder. Some uh, key shortcuts. You should really, what I recommend is just looking into the preferences and seeing all the features you probably didn't even know were there, as, um, such as which I'll, I'll demonstrate now. Um, as you can see, uh, when you uh, like auto align um, walls uh, horizontally, um, as you can see. If you were to place like a, a door texture there or something that's 120 units wide, it's it's actually picked up the offset from the from when I um, align the star tan. But something really quick you can do is just look at it and press Shift R. That will reset it to zero. So that's Shift R. I'll do it on these as well. These um, 24 unit long supports. Um, just Shift R. That's done. Um, also, if you look here, there's um, that's actually a switch texture, but you, you might put it down and think, well, I can't see it. Um, a quick way is just to lower and peg it, and then suddenly, there we go, you can see it. Um, if you don't want to do that, you can, um, if, if you just watch how fast my aligning is, if I just do that, um, you'll notice that it's actually shifting up by 8 each time. That's because I've got on the keyboard shortcuts and I've turned the arrows to shift by 8 as opposed to 1, which is a lot quicker. And considering all Doom textures align by 8 units, uh, by uh, along an 8 unit grid, then, um, you, you know, that's it's really helpful. And you wouldn't really need very precise 1 unit aligning unless you've got a custom texture that wouldn't align. Um, as you can see, that's not aligned. Most people know this, but you just look at whichever one you want the aligning to go along. Um, in this case, this one. Just press Shift A on there. It will all auto align along that. Um, yeah, so that's pretty simple. Also, if you look at my, the structure here, there's quite a big symmetrical circle here. Um, you might might think that might take a while to make. You know, or it's it's really easy if you just um, you know, like for example, if I if I just um, do half of it right and then make it so it wraps up there to the middle of it now what you do here is you select this sector control v control uh, control c control v so copy and paste it then just flip the selection vertically um there you, and just put it in place there select the two sectors press shift j it will get rid of that line and join them into one and if you want to delete the little verse just press v press uh, delete over it when you're hovering over it and that's see it's a very symmetrical which which it kind of looks neater and it it just looks more kind of professional um so yeah i'd recommend just basically look at your configure at your uh, preferences settings and just figure out you know change your keys around just get used to them and you can map a lot faster that way um because it's like second nature to me now so yeah anyway i'll see